Hey there YouTube, Zach here from Mystic V, and today we've got the TCG Invasion of Vengeance early leaks courtesy of Giovanni Reina Siena, and then courtesy of them, uh, pick, uh, of, of the organization, picking up all of his leaks. Um, so this is going to go through what has been officially found through apparently, uh, I think the sneak peek in Italy. Uh, so all of the stuff is going to be in, in Italian, all the language, all the words and stuff. So they're not going to possibly have the actual names in the TCG official of the U.S. But we are going to go through and confirm what we have for official sets nowadays. Now this is the 24th of October, so we have a little under four days before the set is sneaked and peaked and revealed. So let's get to it, right? So for the secret rares, we have. Saravis, the crowned ancient sage. Now, uh, that is the ritual monster that was uh, brought out from this set. Uh, he is bumped to secret rare status. Next up is Full Metal Foes Alkahest. Alkahest is that level 1 Metal Foes monster, and I'm proud to see that he's a secret rare. Very deserving of it. Next up, we've got Starving Venom Fusion Dra Dragon. That's the mascot of the set, and it being secret is going to look really nice. Next to it, below that, is Dark Requiem Exceeds Dragon. Now, that's the guy that you rank up with the Phantom Knight's rank up magic. So, good on them. Oh, man, our next one is totally awesome. Tree Toad's renaming is official confirmed, and it is a secret rare. So, hopefully you guys can pull at least one of those out of your boxes. So, next up, Dimensional Barrier. We have confirmed that that was a secret. We've also confirmed that Vermilion Dragon Mech, the... Uh, pseudo blue eyes support that's coming out is also in here as a secret rare and sub terror nemesis archer the floater for the sub terrors is a secret rare so there we have the secret rares now let's go down to the ultra rares Christron c tree which is part of the Christron archetype is an ultra rare barstos Führer, the true draco slayer ah that's the water one i think and that is a uh, confirmed ultra rare for the set Metal Foes Mithrilium. Mithrilium. It's a uh, metal. Uh, metal Foes Mithriel is now called Mithrilium, and it is an ultra rare. That's awesome. So Meteor Black Comet Dragon, the new Red Eyes Fusion support, is an official ultra rare, just like I had assumed. Christron Quandum and Christron Phoenixion are both ultra rares. Also, Teller Knight Botlamius, no longer Vatlamius is a ultra rare as well. So, ooh, Danglong. Danglong is an ultra rare. Awesome. So, uh, Teller Knight Botlamius, the level 4 guy, the one of the highest attacking Xyz monsters in the set. That's level four, that's a rank 4. And uh, Danglong, they're both ultra rares. Catalyst Field, I think that is for the Chemical Beasts. And it is their field spell. And then uh, Ultra Mafis, which is the big level 10 sub terror monster, is also an ultra rare. But we've confirmed that a while ago. So that is actually all the 10, all the 8 secret rares, so that's what has been leaked from the big stuff. Now we're going to go over and take a look at the super rares, and we have Christron Amatrix, Rank Up Magic's Launch of the Phantom Knights, Pod of Avidity, and Paleozoic Opabinia. They're all super rares in this set, so that's great. Pod of Avidity is a super rare. Uh, the Rank Up Magic Launch of the Phantom Knights, both super rares, so that's awesome. They're not going to be super hard to get. But still good cards. Rank up Magic Launch of the Phantom Knights is going to see some pretty awesome play in uh, Raid Raptors. Hopefully we'll see them playing that. Ca uh, what was it? Uh, playing some cool combos with that. Getting out some rank ups with that. Uh, it's a really strong card. And it works really well in rank up in Phantom Knights too. So next up for the rares. Only seven have been officially confirmed for the TCG. And one of them is Meteor Dragon Red Eyes Impact. That is the Meteor Dragon... Uh, that is the Meteor Dragon's uh, TCG name, apparently. Uh, next up, we have Red Eyes Insight. Ooh, Red Eyes Insight is a rare. That's great. That's good. That makes it so that the Red Eyes aren't going to have to spam for secret rares again and have to force and try and get everything out already. That means almost everything in this set, uh, next to the uh, Legendary, Dex Legendary Dex 2 and this, is going to be super easy access. What's wrong with that is the fact that now we're going to poss possibly be seeing some FTK decks coming out for Red Eyes, which involves basically summoning the Meteor Dragon, the and this Meteor Black Comic Dragon, hitting him for 1400 by sending Darkness Metal, and then you play um, Inferno Fire Blast, and then you chain either Serial Spell or you use Magical Stone Excavation, and you hit him for 7000, and then uh, the 1400, and that's 8400 in that's game. But that's, that's an FTK that's pretty scary. Uh, next up, Nine Pillars of the Yang Zing, which is their amazing counter trap that's going to be replacing the Zephyr counter they have. And it's really, really good. And I am really excited to see some Yang Zings come back. 
Next up is the Cliffort Trap card, Cliffort Down, and it is a rare as long as well as Subterra Behemoth Burrowing, which is I think their trap card. Yeah, probably is. And then Constellar Tempest, the uh, the the continuous spell card for Constellars, as well as Saber Reflect, which was an old X uh, Saber card. They're finally getting their TCG release. Now confirmed for a print in the TCG, we have Paternal Seahorse, which is the insanely strong uh, seahorse monster that allows you to basically lower its level, pop a token out, lower its level, pop a token out, lower its level, pop a token out. You can do it three times a turn. It's level seven, and you can use Unmasked Dragon to bring it out, and it's really cool. So there's that. So far confirmed, those were the ones that we know what they are. Uh, there is still a ton of unknowns currently, whether or not they're going to be released in lower rarity or higher rarity yet. These will be updated most likely later on. Full Metal Flows Fusion is still unknown. Genesis Teller Knight, still unknown. Uh, the, where is it, uh, Gradle Slime Jr., hoping it's at least a rare. You know, if not, that's no big deal. Pretty much expecting Bisma Gear, the Rare Metal Foes uh, level 1 monster, is going to be at least a super rare. If not, that'll suck. Uh, so far... Looking through, I can see uh, Stygia Kraken. Not con I don't know if he's confirmed to be a super rare or if he's just going to be a common. The spiral is the spiral stuff has been either confirmed for rare or ultra rare or, or super, so have no idea about that stuff. And then the Paleozoics, I'm almost certain they're going to be commons, of course. So let's take a look at some of the cards themselves. So I'm going to click on that. Oh, very nice. And these are all Italian, of course, so we've got this, this. We've got Danglong over here, pretty, pretty, pretty. And then Bot Lamias over here. Oscar Tel Cavalier. Cavalier? Hmm, I don't speak Italian. But this looks like Dark Teller Knight Bot Lamias. I didn't get to take a look at Italian when I was younger. So, And then we've got the Rank Up Magics of the Phantom Knights. We've got freaking totally awesome Davero Respotente. So there you go. I'm probably butchering these. I'm sorry, any of the Italian people that watch this channel. Uh, Dimensional Barrier here, Secret Rare. Uh, the Rare Red Eyes Insight, Rare Saber Force, Constellar Tempest. This was that ritual I was talking about way up at the beginning. Saravis. And then the Nine Branches and the Secret Rare Subterror Nemesis Archer. And then there's that seahorse I told you about. And it is not level 7. It is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. I can't count, sorry. Some of the Christians have been confirmed ultra rare, which means that the Christian extra deck is probably going to be super pretty. Citri is the little guy, and then, you know, the Comet Dragon. Ooh, Barstos Fuhrer. Here's the water dude. This may see some play in Mermails. I'm not certain. Um, Cliffort Down and Amatrix. These are the leaked images thanks to these guys up here. And that about wraps it up, guys. I hope you guys liked watching this leak video. And if you did, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll catch you later. This is Mystic V. I'm all leaked out. I'll catch you guys later.